pesan. morning guys it is currently 6 57 on a monday i figured i would do an updated day in the life of a dental assistant because the last one i did was last year and things have changed drastically um for those of you that are new my name is annabelle thank you guys so much for watching um today i'm basically going to show you like what my day looks like typical day but today is like actually really busy, so I figured today would be the best day. Um, at work, I have a full schedule this morning and this afternoon. So I can, probably won't be able to film at work because, you know, HIPAA. But um, 
after work i do have to go to target and do some like oh my god you guys have no gas <laughs> i do have to go to target and do some like last minute travel um errands because i'm going out of town this weekend um i have to get gas apparently <laughs> i forgot i literally forgot i have to get gas um but right now i'm waiting for the car to heat up a little bit i am about to drop off rex at my mom's house because long story short he barks a lot when he's by himself so he can't um stay here by himself all day because he literally barks so loud that i already got one noise complaint like a while back this was months ago so i don't even like um we tried so many things you guys we tried um what's it called crate training we tried um not a shock collar but like it's a collar where he barks and then like it sprays like a like a nasty smell for them not for us it's like a lemon smell that apparently dogs don't like lemons um he didn't care it was like nothing to him he kept barking over it and so last resort was we take him to mom's house like a daycare and right now he does have like a lazy eye because <laughs> my girl got soap in his eye when they showered him yesterday so yeah that's my morning routine i had to drop him off and pick him up like a little child every day <laughs> right yes <laughs> Welcome to Starbucks. What can I get for you today? Hi, can I just do a bacon gouda sandwich? Sure, one bacon gouda. Can I get you anything else? That's it. 478. We'll see you up here. Thank you. So I stopped at Starbucks to get a little breakfast sandwich because I think those bananas are not going to do it for me. And there was literally no line at the Starbucks. So I'm like, might as well stop and get something to eat no school today so there's literally no freaking traffic at all let's go cool. oh a whole ass trailer nice yeah so now we are officially on the way to work my lunch time it's around noon right now i usually go on lunch at 1 p.m but i had to um squeeze in a patient at one so i'm going on lunch from 12 to 1 and i'll be back by one um which kind of sucks because i feel like the later i go on lunch the faster my afternoon goes but what are you gonna do um, but yeah, so I forgot to meal prep. I usually meal prep for the week. I didn't really have the energy to do it yesterday. So I ordered um, sushi. I'm about to go pick it up. It's like down the road from the office. Um, I haven't had sushi from this place in like forever, probably like years. So hopefully it's good. I just really been craving sushi. Like I love sushi so much. But yeah, so far so good. Um, the morning was like busy. Like I said, I had a full column which means I like literally have back-to-back -back patients. Um, and I usually like having my Mondays to like do like paperwork, phone calls, things like that. I can like be good for the week. But today, by the looks of it, I'm not gonna have time to do that. So no big deal. Um, I really hope this week flies by so I can like go on vacation on Friday. Super excited for that. I'll show you guys my sushi once I get it. Okay, guys, so. Oh, beef. Oh, just kidding. 
super yummy. And then it comes with a salad. This is like their lunch special. Oh my god, this looks so good. I'm about to devour. I'm off. It is 5.04. I got off exactly at 5 p.m. So it was a good day when you get off at 5 p.m. Um, I am on my way right now to Target so I can get my last minute travel stuff. And then I have to pump gas because I still don't have gas. And then probably go pick up Rex from my mom's house. And then finish packing when I get home. So yeah. I'll probably film when I'm at Target. Okay guys, so I just got home from my full day. Um, Amazon, something in the mail. For, from Amazon. Um, let's see what it is. The scarf that I ordered for my trip this weekend. I'm trying to go for like this white, or not white, it's probably like a cream color vibe. You know? It matches my gloves and my hat, or my beanie, I guess you would call it. But let me guys, let me show you guys what I bought from Target. I always get little loofahs for when I go out of town. Um, yeah. Um, next I bought more makeup remover, makeup removing wipes from Neutrogena. I always get the twin pack, that way it lasts me a few weeks. And I got some earrings. Because I never have earrings on these because I always lose them or whatever. So I got some earrings from Target. Next, I got some puppy shampoo for Rex. We love the Burt's Bees. This is the oatmeal um, scent. This is so oh. Literally, it doesn't smell like anything. It's great. But yeah, I had to re up on that. And then this guy right here. Let me put you guys on. If. Literally the day we moved into this apartment, it felt so like humid in here. I was like, what the hell is going on? But like, obviously like, I guess like the AC was like at a really high temperature, like it was really hot and it was like summertime at the same time. But then I bought this, um, let me see if I can show you guys. I bought this little guy right here. So you have to buy these tablets to go in it. Basically what this is, it's like, it gets rid of like humidity. This is right here, it tracks attracts and traps excess moisture eliminates eliminates musty orders and no mess obviously but um i keep mine in the corner of the living room you like you literally can't see it but then you have to put these little droplets in there and then it like collects all the moisture they have this little contraption thing and then they have um like little bags like literal bags that you put like anywhere, like in your closet, in the bathroom, in the laundry room. Let me show you guys, because I have those as well. So I have mine in my, if you didn't know, my bathroom and my laundry are like basically the same thing. But um, I have this guy here. So this also does the same thing. It like, whatever is in here collects like the moisture and then it's in there. I figured I would put one in the laundry. I figured I would put one in the laundry because obviously like, you know, it's a laundry room, so it probably gets like moist in there. But yeah, so that's basically all I got. Um, I might should I vlog? Should I show you guys me packing, me finishing packing? Okay, guys. So as you can see, I have the basics in here. So like a few outfits, pajamas. I have my beanie, um, my socks. Which now that I'm thinking about it. I might have to take this out because we get there so early that I'm gonna be like cold. So this is my travel toiletry bag. Have, this is Miguel, so this is gonna stay here because he's not going. Um, have my facial cleanser, my toothpaste, dry shampoo, um, body wash. I have lotion in there. I have bar soap just in case. I have Q-tips. And 
a lip roller. So, um, excuse me. In here, I'm gonna put my loose I just bought. I'm gonna put a deodorant as well. I might as well pack one of these. So I'm gonna put one of these little boys in here. Putting my deodorant in here as well. That's all I need. Oh, and then on this side I have like um, pads in case. Should I just put my perfume in here now? So I really don't want to bring my super expensive um, perfume and then like risk this breaking in there. So I'm gonna bring this. It's like the super tiny, tiny one. Um, hopefully it lasts me the whole time over there. But I just really don't want to bring anything expensive and like they break it in the plane. Um, these shoes I will be bringing with me, but I'm gonna um, wear these on the plane because you know they're heavy. <laughs> Um, I guess I'll throw my toothbrush in here, like, last minute. You know, like, right before I leave. I'm gonna pack my scarf in there as well. I guess what I'll do is, like, um, whenever we go to check in into the hotel, I'll just, like, I'm gonna leave this stuff on top. That way it's easy for me to grab. Um, let's see. Okay, so my mom called, so I had to, like cancel the filming but i have the toiletry bag i bought or i got these booties um like a best of backup i'll probably wear these for the most part though because it's gonna be really cold but just in case we go out at night or something i can wear those panties bras socks are in here as well i should probably move my socks over here yep socks i'm gonna move them over here these are the cute little um do you see like this is the vibe i'm trying to go for oh my god it's off a little bit oh do you want to come too <laughs> um okay well anyways maybe I'll, see these are so small i'm probably gonna put them in my bag you guys what do i what should i do should i just move this into my bag maybe i'll do that i'm gonna put this in my like carry on that way when we get there i don't have to worry about it whatever it's fine wait oh my gosh i'm gonna miss you so freaking much mm, my baby got hurt on the eyeball <gasps> Beautiful baby. Oh my God, you guys, my panties. I'm <laughs> sorry. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like these kind of videos, um, like day in the life of my work, job, whatever, let me know and I'll make more. Um, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe.